Town Hall 8. And up players, it's time to unleash your heroes with all the new hero equipment. Hero equipment gives your heroes cool epic abilities and will open up a whole new dimension of strategies. When you build the new blacksmith, you'll be able to give your heroes different hero equipment as you unlock them. Want to give your Barbarian King the ability to smash through walls with Earthquake Boots? Or maybe give your Archer Queen the ability to summon healers when her ability is activated? Hero Equipment gives you new flexible and tactical skills for you to customize your heroes. Upgrading your Blacksmith unlocks the ability to make your equipment even more powerful. Upgrading your Hero Equipment will require new resources. Shiny Ore, Glowy Ore, or the Starry Ore. The level and the rarity of the Hero Equipment will determine which resource is required. The blacksmith will notify you how much of each resource you need and the amount you need it, depending on whether it's a common hero equipment or an epic one. The more epic the equipment, the cooler the ability it gives your hero. Town Hall 16 is here and it's a force of nature. We mean that the Town Hall 16 update cycle will have an unified static base around this team. Check out the new Giga Inferno that shoots like a focus beam of pure solar energy. It's like using magnifying glass to focus the light from the sun. Not only will you be able to upgrade your Town Hall's defense just like previous Town Halls, you also unlock a new defense mechanic, a new troop, and a new hero pad. Remember in school when you learned 1 plus 1 equals 2? With the new mergeable defenses, 1 plus 1 equals, well, some number greater than 2. How does merging defenses work? Once you reach Town Hall 16, you need to upgrade two defenses to max level before you can merge them. Whoa, that felt really weird. Anyway, from the defense tab of the shop, you'll purchase the ability to merge a defense and place it on your village, just as you would purchase any other defense. When you place the new merge defense, it will let you know which two defenses it's merging. Simply place the merge defense where you have the space, and the builder will do the rest. Merging the defenses does mean two of the defenses now become a single mega defense. The damage and HP the merge the defenses does is higher than their individual versions. It's like getting a super true version of your defenses. For this update, you'll be able to merge enough defenses to create two merge arch towers and two merge cannons. Carry on with the Force of Nature theme, Root Rider smashes into enemy defenses riding atop a massive tree. Wait, hold up, how do you ride a tree into battle? Root Rider is a ground tanky elixir troop available at Town Hall 15. She targets defenses as her primary objective, but moves through walls by destroying them. Root Rider makes a nice alternative to wall breakers, since they're not tricked by open compartments and will always just move towards the nearest defense. You may have noticed in recent days a strange glowing visitor prowling through the forest of your home village. There's a reason he darts around and seemingly vanishes into thin air. Available Town Hall 16, when you upgrade your pet house to level 9, Spirit Fox will phase itself in and out of the visible spectrum, rendering it and your hero invisible up to 5 seconds. With hero equipment, merge defenses, Town Hall 16, and more, this update is going to be one of the most epic ever. So clash on!